With Stitch 4, we brought a new twist to the strategy games on mobile phones. Amazing, controllable heroes. And with Update 3, we're bringing you the darkest of them all. Kulan Van Dyne, aka the Prince of Bones. Isn't that such an exciting name? He's a magic-based hero. He uses his soul beam ability to curse enemy buildings so they'll take more damage. Not only that, but he'll raise troops from their graves to do his bidding during battle. What we wanted was a new and exciting environment, one filled with rot to venture and danger around every corner. We played with some colors and concepts, and we came up with the undead graveyard. Wait until you see the boss fight. Do we ever have a surprise for you? It takes everything you know about Siegefall battles and switches it up. Victory! Did you think we were done there? Oh, no. <laughs> the gargoyle is going to be our first flying troop, which is going to open up a whole new layer of strategic gameplay. Look out for the gargoyle's powerful fireball attack. It's sure to cause a ton of destruction to enemy kingdoms. What's a Siege Fall update without new cards? We brainstormed some great ideas and came up with new cards that are going to spice up your battle deck. The Phoenix is the new ultimate card everybody will want in their deck. It's a fiery bird of destruction and healing potential if you time it correctly. The surprises aren't over. Imagine if you had someone to collect resources for you while you're battling through the divided lands. Well, that's happening. Meet our tribal monkeys, who've come from a far-off land to pay tribute to you as a great ruler. You'll find them around your kingdom willing to go on missions for you to bring back well-needed resources. Pay them in gold, because for some reason, they don't take bananas. New hero, new chapter, new missions, new cards. If we haven't had tribal monkeys, so guys, I really have to go now, I, have, I gotta play. See you on the battlefield. Hey, wait Anthony, you gotta finish the video. 